Ed Friedland, the Bass Whisperer, here once again for Guitar World Magazine. This month we're looking at the Yamaha RBX4 A2 Bass. Now the A stands for AIR Technology or Advanced Internal Resonance, which is what Yamaha has named uh, their idea that's behind this instrument. It's very interesting. They take lightweight, soft woods and then they surround it with hard tone woods which are typically heavier and the end result is a base that weighs virtually nothing this thing weighs 7.3 pounds which is really nice on a long gig of course a lot of people think that you need a certain amount of weight and uh, consistency of material to get a really good bass sound but in fact this this really works hey it really really works check it out Lots of sustain, lots of fundamental, good consistency from string to string. Another interesting feature of the A2 is their bridge design. It's a very minimalist die cast bridge that has three sound tubes that travel through the thickness of the body. They're anchored in the back with these three screws, that's what holds it on and the tubes allow the string vibration to travel through the thickness of the instrument and sort of activate the various layers of tone wood that are involved in the body's construction. They're telling you here that the bass is made in Indonesia and I think this means that it's not trash. The A2 has lots of fun cosmetic details like this pinstriping which gives the bass a sort of pimped out sports car vibe. The lighted volume controls are another fun touch. They dim as you roll off the level of each pickup. You know, I don't think there's any real practical reason for this. It just looks cool. It's kind of fun. I just wish they would have had a light for the tone control, maybe green or yellow, or how about all the way open, it's yellow, and then as you roll off the highs, it turns green or something like that. The A2 is essentially a modern styled jazz bass instrument with two single coil pickups with blades. Uh, the positioning is roughly, the bridge is roughly 70's jazz positioning. And the front pickup is right in line with where the treble coil on a P bass might be. Let's hear how it sounds finger style, both pickups up full and the treble uh, tone control wide open. here with just the front pickup. Now we're going to roll off to the back pickup mainly and hear how that sounds. Of course, with a passive instrument, you don't have the drastic tone shaping capabilities that you'd get with Active EQ, but still with the passive tone control, you can roll the highs off and change the character of the instrument quite nicely. I'm going to roll some treble off, put the uh, tone control right about in the middle. Now here's just the front pickup with the treble rolled off, a little fat chunky P bass action. Now I'm going to roll off to the back pickup with the treble control turned halfway down. Yeah, 
Yamaha added some architectural details to the headstock that look neat. I like these recessed tuning pegs, they're very slick. The base has a maple neck and a rosewood fingerboard, no dots. And that plug is there to keep the volume control lights on. It only works when the instrument's plugged in. Looking down the neck, we can see the body has an arched top. This is cool. Look at how they curve the pickups to match the fingerboard radius, which is 10.5, by the way. Yamaha calls these YASH custom shop built pickups. The A2 also gets a great slap tone. Let's hear what that sounds like with both pickups up full, treble all the way open. like the slap tone on a on a bass with just the front pickup open it gives it that kind of hollow chunky thing let's hear that now let's hear the slap tone on just the back pickup also gets a really cool pick sound. Here we go, both pickups up full. Now pick style with just the front pickup. Now pick style with just the back pickup. The Yamaha RBX4 A2 is a really cool looking instrument. It's got some neat uh, design elements and architectural features that make it really subtly stand out from the crowd. It's got a great tone. It weighs seven pounds. Hey, that's all right with me. Check it out.